Good morning, here we are back again with another Atlas Coffee Club subscription box. Today we have... Ooh, Kenya. My favorite coffee regions. Okay, maybe a little bit of a caramel syrup. Light root. Oh, drop some light roasted. Nothing too distinct. A little spicy. A little caramel. Almost maybe even a little leather. So we'll grind this up, brew this up, and check it out. Oh, that crema bloomed right up nicely. Hmm. Smells a little Central American. It's a little spice, caramel, maybe a little leather, a little woodsiness. Let's pour this. The flavor is a little bit different than what the aroma is. Um, to me, this is not your traditional Kenyan coffee. It doesn't quite have the bright fruitiness that I might expect from a lot of those, uh, but there is fruit. There is like a like a Macintosh apple, a little bit of a dry and, and bitter apple, crisp. There is uh, some cinnamon and some woodsy, almost like a little bit of a hay note. Very good though. This is a very drinkable coffee. Yeah, it's, it's apple all day long. I, uh, I wouldn't have nailed this if I were to guess as necessarily Kenyan, but I love it. Let's see what they have to say about it. So Kenya. And red apple, sure, baking spice, and oat milk. Medium roast, I would agree. This is a medium roast on the slightly lighter spectrum. This month, discover a hidden gem from Kenya's Rift Valley. Experience a smooth oat milk-like body with delicious notes of crisp red apple. And a bite of baking spice warming the palate. Very true. Very true. Good stuff. Uh, thank you again, Atlas Coffee Club. Another one of yours. You know, I have to take a look and see how long I've been with Atlas Coffee Club, but it's probably longer than a year because COVID's been longer than a year. And maybe I'll do a longer review of um, you know, overall what I think of them, which is a thumbs up. And uh, in short, we're going to give this a score of 7.0, very strong score. As always, pray, hope, don't worry, and drink coffee.